here's our crab brilliano yes wow look at that it's so good so delicious another crab recipe is in the making come join me in my kitchen this is irene saragosa thanking you for watching hungry buddies let's start we start with our crab relleno we have the garlic and the onions we have to saute them and to start the sweating we have to put some pepper, a pinch of pepper, and a pinch of salt. And stir. Now our onions and garlic are smelling good. We have to add the cube carrots and potatoes. Here again, and another salt and pepper, just a pinch, and a dash, and stir until it gets tender. Let's try the potato. Mmm, it's now cooked. We have to turn off the fire. I have here 14 ounces of crab meat. I did not cook it. It's only this one that I cook. The garlic, the onions, and the carrots, and the potatoes. Then I have to mix it here. Then we have to add also the chopped pepper. And then to mix this. Mix as well. To stuff our crab shell, we have here a mixture of our crab meat and veggies, and then two eggs that we need to scramble, and then we have to mix it here, and then two tablespoons of flour. the shell and clean it and then I did not remove the fatty part here so every time you scoop it you will taste the very best of the crabs so we'll start stuffing this now this on the corner some meat now we are frying our crab relleno we have to fry the other side first because uh, we need to make sure that it won't spread you know the filling or the stuffing will not spread You just have to fry this in low fire. Now I turned it on the other side and then after a little bit we will put this continue putting this in the oven 375 for 20 minutes. Now this will go to the oven 375 degrees for 15 to 20 minutes. Here's our crab brilliano. Yes. Wow look at that. It's so good, so delicious. And you can eat it with tartar sauce or you want it with ketchup or whatever kind of relish you want. That would work. Thank you for watching Hungry Buddies. This is Irene Saragosa. See you next time. Bye.